Alright, chill, what is going on guys? And today we're back with another banger video. And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, don't really know what I'm gonna be doing today. I do know that I'm gonna go stop by the manga store though, because apparently there were some new releases. So we'll see if this turns into a manga video, whatever is the case. But I just recorded two sit down videos, which you guys might have saw one already, and then you'll probably see one after this video. So just finished recording, gotta put the lights away and all that stuff. So yeah, I actually got Milo and Itachi with me because I'm watching Milo. So they're both chilling right there. Look at them sleeping on the couch. Well, sleeping on the bed, looking so cute. Oh, look at the little boys. Oh, sorry, Tachi. I didn't mean to wake you up, bro. Damn, why are you looking into my soul like that, though? But nonetheless, just sit back, relax, and enjoy this vlog. Hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel because we post every other day, which is probably better than your favorite YouTuber. Unless, of course, I'm your favorite YouTuber. feel like I haven't done that line in a minute. But uh, yeah, it's actually really beautiful out today, so I don't want to sit inside anymore. Again, I've been recording stuff since 10 o'clock this morning. It's 12.24. I made a bunch of TikToks, made some YouTube videos, and yeah, 76 degrees outside right now. It's going to be a high of 82, so I probably don't even need this sweatshirt because I got a beanie on because I just don't want to do my hair. I'm going to sweat, so let's just go. Out. All right, y'all, I just took the train. Now we're at Bryant Park, so yeah, let's walk to the manga store now. All right, we got voiceover souls in the cut. I figured, you know what, I'm gonna start doing voiceovers more like when I'm out by myself, especially because like one, I don't have somebody like recording me. Two, it's noisy in a lot of places. But the first stop we have is Kino Kanua. I still can't pronounce that name. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right, but I saw this outside. They had the Attack on Titan Uniglow collection at the bookstore. I was like, oh shoot, like I didn't know that was a thing. So that was kind of cool. Um, and then we were looking at some of the Sony Angels and like the Smiskis. I don't even know how to say it, the little figures that I'd be getting the mystery ones. Um, but let's go to the newly released section. Like I said, that's pretty much what we came here for. So we're looking for a few things. First thing we're gonna look for is Kaiju number eight, which is volume six, which we do need. The next thing that I found, which is actually pretty cool, was um Ayashi. I, I don't know how to say, I don't, again, I, I'm not pronouncing nothing today, but basically that series came out, but apparently it never got finished, so I don't know if I want to start collecting it if it's not finished. Um, this is a new series as well, Tista, this is volume one, I kind of want to get it, but I held off today, I was just going for the stuff that I'm actually reading, uh, Real Account, this is mainly what we came for, like this is what I'm fiending to read, um, and then The Tunnels to Summer, another one that's like the second one on the list, and then Kaiju and Sakamoto Days, then they had all the Nendroids still, which is really, really tough, the Hinata and Itachi is so fire like i want to buy them but they're like 60 cash each then we found these we found these hunter mysteries but again i was just going for manga today and i really wanted to cop these but i was like you know what i need to chill because they were 12 dollars each and that's literally a whole manga volume so yeah blood on the tracks started reading it i only have volumes one two three i was looking to see if they had volume four they didn't have it so i can't really continue it right now until i find volume four found go go loser ranger volume one which is another volume that i do need so i will be picking this up so i could start it because i do have volumes two and three already then we went to the funko section and like i said i'm only copping manga today but i wanted up seeing this this madara uchiha pop and i was like bro come on it, like they were testing me today i really i might have to go back low key but we'll see but yeah there's some other cool funkos they had some more naruto mystery stuff which was kind of cool as well but again don't really need it all and they had these weird like naruto vinyls things where they'd be like changing the outfits of characters i mean itachi looked pretty badass i'm not gonna lie even though he's in like pajamas he still looked fire but pause they had blue lock stuff but look at the price on this yeah look at that price 17.99 for a little blue lock character that i don't even care about like that but yeah the sony angels again like i said i didn't buy any but i really did they're only eight dollars at the bookstore which most places be charging more now because they are very popular but hey i almost bought it all right y'all 60 dollars later and we're leaving the manga store and i stuck to strictly manga i would have dead bought the the obi the madara uchiha pop i would have bought the hunter mysteries the sony angels but i was like you know what i'm only gonna buy manga today so yeah let me cross the street all right, second stop of the day and my second favorite store after Kino Kanuai is Book Off. I love finding just the random things. Like you go in here and you never know what you're actually gonna find because it's like it's like a thrift shop for like you know like anime like manga e type things even though it's not like as ex it's like a second street i guess if you guys know what second street is it's like that's kind of it's not really a thrift shop but they still have unique pieces here and there um but they do charge sometimes this charges a little bit but yeah wanted up finding a bunch of cool funko pops today like somebody must have just sold their whole collection because they had like a lot of like you know characters that go together like they had a bunch of inuyashas they had a bunch of sailor moon characters and then this one right here it looked interesting but i don't know what this is from so if anybody knows comment it down below i just 
uh, yeah i never seen this before and i was just like oh that's a cool funko pop like the colors look nice and then we were looking back over here to see if they still had the stan lee uh comic cover but they didn't i should have bought it that time it was like 35 dollars but i wanted up picking up some manga instead um and then if you guys remember the last time we were at book off which is when i saw the stan lee we sold a bunch of our duplicate dorables so we sold like all these dorables like 60 dorables they gave me like 16 dollars right they're selling each of them for three dollars like each dorable cost three dollars which i mean honestly that's not like crazy i guess like i mean that makes sense but like it's just funny to me like they gave me 16 dollars for 60 right then they sold like there's none left like so they must have sold them all like a lot of people must have been buying doorables from here because they're not out on display i give them 60 doorables and there's only three that i saw if you guys see any let me know but i only saw like three to four then i found this gem and i know i said i was only buying manga today but bro five dollars for this when it's a 40 dollar pop in box yeah you're bugging i'm copping that um and then they had this naruto box set for a hundred dollars i wish they would have had that back when i was you know looking for the naruto box sets now i got them all but i paid freaking retail price for them and then this is the other series i bought last time i was here i haven't caught up to volume four yet because i bought the first four volumes so i'm not gonna pick up more until i read the first four i'm having a little bit of self-control today and then again blood on the tracks they ain't have any other volumes we said volume one so couldn't get that today and then yeah i was just mainly looking through the manga section i love just walking through here because again you don't know what you're gonna find it's not like kino it's like it has like a bunch of older stuff as well and then i saw samurai number eight which is a series by the creator of naruto which i really do want to get it's only five volumes all right y'all so i actually just got to amanda's house i'm not with amanda but i'm at amanda's house because she wanted me to pick up something for her i gotta go find it and stuff but i'm at amanda's house you guys saw i did wind up copping a few things um i tried to stick with just manga today like i would have bought the hunter thing i would have bought that toby pop i would have bought the the obito maduro uchiha pop i would have bought what else was there There was some other stuff too book off even had some like cool little finds as well i had to buy that kawaki though that's the only reason i folded i folded on that because that's like a 40 dollar pop 35 40 dollar pop in box right it's five dollars i was like yo i don't even have my boruto pops in their box like i have them out of the box on a little boruto stand like on a stand thing so i was like doesn't really make a difference if I have a box for this one. And that one's just cool. Like, it has his karma going up his arm and stuff. So, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get it. It's five bucks. And then I wanted up finding Visitor Volume 4. I'll show you everything when I get home. But I'll give you a quick little recap. But, uh, yeah, successful uh, manga thing. I got all the new releases that I wanted. i um, been fiending to read Real Account. Uh, I got Sakamoto Days. I got a few other things, you guys. I'm, I'm not going to talk too much about it because I'll probably show you quickly at the end of the video. But... Yeah, I'm happy with everything I got. No more shopping today. That's it. I ended up spending like $78 today after everything. So $78 little haul. Not too bad. Again, I held back though. I did hold back. Your boy held back to the most part. I mean, I still wanted up buying just manga, but that's really just what I wanted. So yeah, let me find the stuff for Amanda and then I'll pick up the vlog once I get home. We might, I don't know, we might have to stop at Target because I do need paper towels. I don't really want to stop and target for paper towels, but I have two dogs in the crib right now and I need paper towels. Never mind, we're not stopping at Target. I'm just robbing Amanda for some paper towel because she has a lot. So I was walking home and I was like, yo, I'm passing the thrift shop. So might as well stop in the Salvation Army real quick before we head home. All right, so like I said, we're going to stop by the thrift shop real quick. I always come in and just check here whenever I'm in the area because, like, you know, you never know what you're going to find. You guys noticed me and Amanda came here a lot in the past couple of vlogs, but first floor, they ain't have nothing. Literally nothing. Then I came to the clothes. The clothes for me, honestly, I never find clothes here. I think, like, in a vlog the other day, I found, like, clothes here for, like, the first time, but the clothes here is pretty terrible. Um, but I found this, like, Brooklyn thing. It was cool, I guess. Then this was cool, right? But it was like a v-neck sweatshirt and i was like eh but then i was thinking like i could cut off the hood make it look cool but nah i was just like ah, it's not even worth it so then i wanted looking up at the books just to see if they had any manga they had this korean sword art online thing but i was just like bruh it's not even worth it like i i can't read it i already bought one last time so yeah i found this cool star wars clone wars thing though brought me back to my childhood pretty sure it was in french though i just got home and i'm taking these two little rascals out because i know they gotta pee so hey tata say what's up say what's up milo okay all right, y'all, so we are back at the crib. I'm just going to give you a little quick recap of what I wanted up copying. So at Book Off, you guys saw, I did wind up getting Visitor Volume 4 because I have Volumes 2, 3, and 5. I bought them off of Rate Stuff Anime for like a dollar each, and this one was three bucks. Three bucks, and I was like, damn, I still need Volume 1, so I can't even read the series, but I'm just trying to find Volume 1 of Visitor. Then the reason we went to the manga store today was for all of this because I was waiting for certain things. Basically, if you guys saw any of my other manga videos, 
Go Go Loser Ranger is the series I wanted to start. Again, I got volumes two and three. I couldn't read it yet because I needed volume one. They had volume one at the manga store, thank God. Now, these four right here just came out yesterday. Like they literally just came out yesterday and I didn't go yesterday because I was waiting to go today because I don't have school today. And I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get them. And I was hoping they had everything. Blue Lock comes out next week, so I couldn't get Blue Lock because apparently it comes out a week later than all of these ones for some reason. But I was able to get The Tunnel to Summer, um, Volume 3. I really did enjoy Volumes 1 and 2 of this series, which I got during the Barnes & Noble sale. Then, Real Account, you guys know I've been on Real Account for months and months and months, and I'm finally caught up. I'm caught up in the manga, so the most recent one that came out is 21 and 22, and I think the final volumes come out in August. So once that comes out, Real Account will be done, and I'll have the complete collection. And then Kaiju number eight, uh, if you guys saw in like the vlog two days ago or something like that, um, I was looking for volume six at Target, they didn't have it, so I wanted up getting volume six. And then Sakamoto Days volume seven, which I didn't even read volume six of it yet, and I've had it for like months, so I gotta read that so I can read volume seven. And uh, yeah, I don't know why I didn't read it, I just remembered right now that I didn't read volume six, but yeah, so that was the quick little manga haul. $60 later, but um, we did cop Kawaki right here, Kawaki Uzumaki right here, and um, if you know, you know, and yeah, $5, I'm not gonna complain about it, literally, it's like a $35 pop, my, my food's cooking, it was like a $35, $40 pop, they even had it at Book Off not too long ago, and I saw it in there, and I wanted it, and again, I was just not paying the $35, $40, so yeah, they got Kawaki right here with the karma seal on his arm and a little on the eye right there. So tough. And then today, like when I'm recording this, the whole new Boruto wave just got announced. So those are coming soon. But let's go put this guy on the shelf because very excited about him. And this is what I was talking about with my Boruto section. I don't know if you guys can see. Boom, that's the Boruto section. So I already have a Kawaki, but this one is different. Obviously, he has like the printing all over him. That one's just like regular. So I don't know where I'm going to put him. I might just put him in the front low key. He might have to lean. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to put him like right there or something. Something like that. So yeah, Kawaki's gonna have to stand at the front right there with Boruto. And then we got Boruto with the with the Karma Seal as well. So yeah, now that I got both of them, very excited. And then when all the new Boruto pops come out, I don't know what I'm gonna do, cause it's full. So I'm actually about to eat and stuff right now and probably watch some new anime that came out over the weekend that I missed. Um, But let me put away all the manga first in the spots that it goes. So Visitor, Volume 4, as I was saying, I have Visitors, Volume 2, 3, and 5. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fit it. I might have to squeeze it, let's see. Okay, boom, so two, three, four, five, they all fit. Still need volume one so I could actually read it. But for right now, it's gonna stay in my little Tokyo pop collection. I mean, I might read this today, low key. Like, I really am fiending to read this, but all my real account volumes are down here, so let's put it on the show. So, boom, we got them all right here. And it's actually weird, because it's like three volumes, like each, and then for some reason on this one, they only decided to do two instead of the three that they normally do. Now, all these do go on this rack right here, so. In three, two, one, let's see if it even makes a difference. Okay, boom. Like, it literally just goes in. Like, you can't even tell. But volume three is right here. Volume one is right here. Volume seven here. Volume six here. So, yeah, was able to fit everything. All right, we're about to eat and watch some anime. So, let's go. I'm on a road, I can't get caught. I'm a bit different stage. Hop my mama blowing on my phone, seeing if I'm okay. I had to get up out the hood, 